March 14th, or 314, is known as Pi Day. Although this may mean you can celebrate by eating pie on that day, that's not really the pie we're talking about. We're referring to the number pie, which is about 3.14, the same as today's date. But what really is pie? Pi is defined as the ratio of any circle's circumference to its diameter. Picture a string in the shape of a circle. If you were to uncircle the string, basically just laying it out in a straight line, the length would be about 3.14 times as long as the diameter. The idea of pi has been around for almost 4,000 years. In ancient Babylon, it was known that the ratio of the circle's circumference to its diameter was a fixed value, which they estimated as 25 eighths or 3.125. In ancient Egypt, they estimated it as 16 ninths squared, or 3.16. Around 250 BC, Greek mathematician Archimedes calculated pi to be between 3.1408 and 3.1429. Over the years, mathematicians from all over the world were able to calculate pi to even more accurate digits. From China to India to Persia to Europe, by the end of the 17th century, pi had been calculated to 71 digits. With the invention of computers in the 20th century, mathematicians were able to calculate pi to even more digits. In 1949, pi was calculated to 1,120 digits thanks to computers, and this number has steadily risen since, with the current record now being 100 trillion digits of pi. If you're wondering, the Guinness World Record for memorizing digits of pi is 70,000. Luckily for you though, your calculator probably has a pi button, so you won't have to worry about memorizing pi. Have a happy pi day!